the camera over to David himself to do some of that internal work. He's taking the camera free mode, and I'm just going to go take a little drop. Well, th thanks very much there, Rodney. Okay, you look after yourself, and we'll, we'll see you back here All shortly. All right, see you in a bit. All righty. Well, we're back inside the bongo, and the first thing I want to draw your attention to, especially for my friends at uh, Pier Parts, is that if you look at the inner uh, two ports on the intake side, they are dark and quite black, whereas the other two are quite clean. What do we have happening there, do you think? Uh, that looks kind of unusual, and I haven't examined exactly whether it's just soot or what it is, but it is definitely blackened up, as you can see here. That is a tell, tail tell because we're dealing with cylinder number two. I've removed all the injectors and I've lined them up uh, above their appropriate cylinder and they are consistent in terms of their uh, injecting. Seems to be relatively consistent color. So I don't suspect there's any problem with the injectors. But there's definitely something that's been happening here. So we're going to investigate a little further when we get the head off. That being the next step, I just have to remove the front cover again, belt, tensioner. Then we can focus on removing the head bolts and the whole head is an assembly.